Hi guys, back with another quick video. Wanted to come on and talk about a couple of things. The first thing is the Back to Mac program. In case you're not familiar with it, Mac is committed to the environment. And because of that, when you purchase Mac products and you finish them or the products that you don't use or have gone bad, you can take six of your empty products back to Mac and get a free product. Now, depending on where you take it, of course, depends on what you can get for it. If you take six empty products back to a retail location, you can get a lipstick. If you take it back to a freestanding store or a pro store, you can get a lipstick, a lip glass, or an eyeshadow. Now, a retail location would be something like a mat counter inside Macy's or inside Dillard's or inside Nordstrom. That's what I consider to be or they consider to be a retail location. I think you get more bang for your buck if you have a freestanding location or a pro store in your area because you have a choice of three different products instead of just getting a lipstick. Now, if you're not near any of those, you can also send your three products back online and get a lipstick. That's not bad considering you have MAC things that you haven't used or it's a color that you just didn't want. It's been sitting in the back of your drawer and it could have gone bad, rank, just totally disgusting and you can take it back. I do have a lot of friends that use MAC products sparingly and they'll give me their free products or their, their empty products and I'll back to MAC them. As a makeup artist, I tend to do back to MAC quite a bit because I'll depot a lot of the items to make it easier for my pro kit and then I'll have a whole lot of things to take back. For instance, I just depotted some of my foundations and was able to take back like 12 bottles and I got two products for those 12 bottles of foundation. Now some of the items that you can take back of course are just anything that is a primary MAC product. A lipstick, a foundation, mineralized skin finish, anything that comes with the MAC uh, symbol on it basically and if you back to MAC something you can't return it. That's, a, that's another thing is once you've back to MAC a product and you've gotten something you can't return or exchange it. So you need to be pretty sure about the item that you get when you uh, turn your six products in. I did do a back to Mac recently and I picked up a few products. I actually have quite a bit of things and depending on the location that you go to will depend on the number of items that you can take back and receive free. In the location that I went to, they only allow you to bring back enough to get four free products. So that's a total of 24 empty containers. So the limit in that particular store is 24 empty products. So you can get four free back to Mac products, but check in your local area and see what the limit is. I've gone to a pro store location or not a pro store, but a freestanding location. And I was able to back to Mac uh, just an unlimited amount of things. I remember I took enough back to get like 11 products. So it really depends on the location, on the people that are working, on the, on the artists that are working, and sort of what that location's limits are. So check each location. They're going to be different based on the store, based on the personnel, based on the store manager. So just because the limit that I have at the freestanding store that I took the things back to was 24 empties, yours may be different but I do have still quite a few empty products and I should have taken them in hindsight I should have taken them to the um, retail location also in the mall that I went to but I didn't because I prefer getting eyeshadows as a makeup artist those go a little farther for me uh, than the lipsticks because I have a ton of lipsticks already so I'll take them back another day and get maybe four or uh, four more products that I have enough for I think. Let me show you the items products. that I got when I did the back to MAC. Um, I got two lipsticks and two eyeshadows. And now with the back to MAC program, they will not allow you to get the individual pro pan of the eyeshadows. You have to get the regular eyeshadows. And for me, I'll just depot these and then take the container back and I can back to MAC those containers. But what I got for Back to Mac is two eyeshadows and I got the color 
mystery and it's a satin and it's a very deep dark sort of uh taupey brown color you can see that and this will be great for a smoky look it's a very dark brown you can see that and this will be great to smoke out things the next eyeshadow that I got is espresso and you've seen espresso a hundred times it's just a reddish brown a taupey red brown that's also great for smoking things out very pretty and the two lipsticks that I got one is velvet teddy believe it or not I don't have velvet teddy in my collection but it's a beautiful nude a color. This will be great for my deeper toned clients. And I also got the color Up The Amp. I do already have Up The Amp, but I use it quite a bit because it is just that perfect muted sort of lilac -y purple that looks great on everyone. So I do tend to use this a lot. So I did re-up my Up The Amp. While I was at the pro store, I did pick up a couple of extra things that I wanted. One is the lip glass or the luster glass in the color Bow, B-A-U-X. And it looks like that. I'm not going to open it because these are for my kit, but it's a beautiful color. And I plan to use this probably with the chestnut lip liner and the velvet teddy lipstick. And then I'll put this over the top. And that will be a beautiful nude for some of my deeper tone clients. Some of the other items that I picked up while I was at the Mac Pro Store. Or I shouldn't say Pro Store. At the freestanding Mac Store. One is this blush in the color Raisin. It's a beautiful color. Now I do have this already in my Pro Kit. But what I did was I have quite a bit of products and I decided to put together sort of a very quick on the go kit that I could keep sort of uh, in my office because a lot of times I do get some calls during the day and someone wants me to come by after work to to do a quick face. So what I decided to do was put together a quick little kit and keep that with me in my office during the day. So if someone called me, I could stop by after work and not have to carry my full uh, pro bag which which is great I had a lot of products that I was that I wasn't using anyway so I didn't really have to buy anything to restock that kit or to stock up that kit I did uh, pick up just a couple of blushes that I needed for that and I'm all good the other blush that I got was was peaches and these are staples in my uh, my primary pro kit so I just figured I'd pick up a couple of these and because I'm a Mac Pro, I'm not paying the full price. I do get 40% off. So the investment wasn't uh, that much for these. So I didn't mind. Now, um, one of my clients had given me a couple of products. Oh, there are a couple more things I did pick up uh, for that second Pro Kit. And that was a Pro Pan eyeshadow in the color Bamboo, which I love. And I use this a lot for the highlight for some of my uh, deeper toned ladies and the other color was uh, that same mystery but also in the pro pan this would be great in my second pro kit now one of my clients had given me some products and you know who you are darling and i returned them to the retail location in a macy's here in that same mall and they had they were purchased from a Mac Macy's and they still had the little uh, Macy's sticker on them. You know how they do the double sticker on the products now. And because I didn't have the receipt and the products didn't come up in the system, I was only able to get like I think nine dollar credit for both of them. But that's fine because it didn't cost me anything. And what I did was I purchased a I paid the difference of like a dollar and something cents. And I got this blush called Breezy. And that is a beautiful color. And I'm going to put that in my um, in my second pro kit. So I, I got this blush for a dollar. I'm proud of myself. I also stopped by the impulse section in the Macy's 
of that mall as well. And I picked up three of the Anastasia lip glosses. Now, I love their liquid lipsticks. They're fantastic. They're a little bit drying. Um, but um, I thought that these would probably be easier for my clients to wear than the liquid lipsticks. And believe it or not, these are extremely opaque. I'm not going to swatch them because they're for my Pro Kit, but I did swatch them in the store. And I'll let you see these. This first color is called Un dressed and this is just a beautiful nude beigey color just absolutely beautiful the next color that i got is called metallic rose and if you can see that i don't know if you can see it but it's got like glitter inside the tube and it looks like this how beautiful is that I'm so excited. I can't wait to use this on my next client. So if, it, if one of my next clients is watching this video, you know you're going to get one of these three. And this beautiful last color is called Runway Red. How gorgeous is this color? And this also has some glitter in it as well. And it is just so amazingly pretty. Look at that. Isn't that beautiful? Can't wait to use this. Cannot wait to use this on a client. But these are the three Anastasia lip glosses that I got. And these are absolutely opaque. I mean, completely opaque. These do not show anything through. So I'm excited to play with these on my next client. Now in that same Macy's Info section, they also carry Inglot. And I love the Inglot gel number 77, which is the black gel liner. So I thought I would pick up these two because they're just beautiful colors. I do like to put color underneath a lot of the client's eyes to sort of give them a pop or even in the tear duct. So I saw these two. One is number 94, which is the more champagne color. And the other is number 95, which is more of the gold color. But look at how beautiful these are. I'm going to put these on my hand. These are just absolutely amazing. And they will be beautiful lid colors as well. And these are creamy, even more creamy than the number 77, which is the black gel liner. But here we go on this side right here. This is number 94. This is more of the champagne color. And then this is number 95. That's more of the gold color. These two are absolutely beautiful and I think they'll be great as lid colors. So if you haven't already picked those up or tried them, I think these will be fantastic on the lid. So try them out. Let me know what you think. Another item that I picked up from the MAC counter is a product that I love, love, love to use for a brown smoky eye. And it is the MAC Fluid Line in dip down it is just a beautiful brown base for a smoky eye if you see that and it if you can see that beautiful brown color right here this blends so well out on the lid and you just pack a brown color on the top and you have one two three the quickest smoky eye that you have ever seen in your life just the quickest quickest easiest perfect smoky eye and you don't you don't you have to use black i love a brown smoky eye because it's just so much more inviting and this just makes it just foolproof i also picked up the nars all day luminous foundation <laughs> and the quick story about this is i actually purchased this about probably a month or two ago probably two months ago and I picked it up in the color Cadiz which is a little bit more orange and a little more deep I tried it on the store it looked fantastic I came home and tried it and it was absolutely too dark I don't have but a little bit of color anyway so I don't need that much color but I tried it in the color Cadiz and that didn't work for me so I took it back today and I traded it in for the color Tahoe and hopefully Tahoe will work for me 
we'll see I'm gonna try it it looked like it was gonna work for me in the store and um, I hope uh, no this actually looks still a little too this isn't gonna work for me either crap oh well I'm gonna try this I'm gonna try it and I'll try this and see what works but I, I don't think this is gonna work it doesn't look it looks a little too dark this is Tahoe so I may have to go one shade darker so one shade lighter now the we'll last see. thing that I want to talk about is something that I got from Namie's Beauty Center in I think they're in LA and if you don't know about Namie's they are a beauty center a beauty supply store that carries all of the major cosmetics brand from NARS to <clears throat> Laura Mercier Dose of Colors um, they also carry just a, a you name it they have it Graftobian just whatever and they also carry the Dose of Colors line and this is the new Dose of Colors limited edition Terra collection it this is their liquid lipsticks and it's in the three colors brick sand and stone and let me open these because I bought these from myself so I can I can show you the swatches of them I really should have had these open but I didn't so this first color that I'm gonna swatch is brick and that is just really a beautiful beautiful brick red color right here that's brick from dose of colors this next one is called sand and this is a beautiful color don't mind the other swatches that I have on my hand and again this is a liquid lipstick so it's gonna dry down matte I do have a couple other colors so this second color right here is sand so that's brick that's sand and the last color is called stone and this is an absolutely beautiful sort of a pinky nude color and that's this third color right here so that's brick that sand and that stone just absolutely beautiful colors I can't wait to wear um, any of them they're just gorgeous so I got those from Namie's Beauty Center and if you go online check them out if you're a makeup artist apply for the pro discount I do get a, I believe it's about 40% discount on all of their products not all of their products are available online so you would have to call the store tell them what what, what you want and they can ship them to you so ch check it out if you're a pro we'd like to save money any way that we can because we know that purchasing products can be quite expensive so check out Namie's Beauty uh, Namie's Beauty Center and it's online because honey who doesn't like a good discount I know I like to save me some money okay but uh, anyway that's it that's all that I have for my video today I wanted to come on tell you quickly about the back to Mac program show you some of the things that I picked up and I promise I'm gonna have a video up or tutorial up for you very very soon I did get a request to do a tutorial on a red smoky eye that I had done recently and I promise that's definitely coming uh, I, the last thing I want to talk about really quick are these beautiful mink lashes that I have on today these are from if you can see these these are from Esquito and I bought these mink lashes probably a year ago and never tried them I just had them in my drawer and I decided today that I would try them and these are the Esquito mink lashes in BFF and they come in this beautiful box I love this box how eloquent does this box look and it comes in a box this this little thing has a little magnet in it so it clasps close and then on the inside there's a little card that talks about the quality how they're made and then the lashes come on this beautiful gold little holder how pretty is that just gorgeous and I bought these they were on sale and I bought them I think for 50% off and I love them this is the first time that I've ever put on the mink lashes and they are extremely comfortable now the colors that I have on my eyes today are from the melt love six stack and on my lips I have the Sephora number 19 purple poison 
lip stain, cream lip stain and just all my regular stuff but anyway that's it that's all I promise I have no more for you today and I'm gonna go ahead and edit this video hopefully I'll get it up for you tonight if not you'll see it tomorrow if you have any questions please list them below and I will respond to those questions please rate this video give me a thumbs up again put your comments below if you haven't already please subscribe because I want to see you here on my next video thank you so much for stopping by my channel and I'll see you in the next video. I'll talk to you again soon. Stay pretty. Deuces.